what's in the fucking box? Your arms too short. Your arms too short. Your arms too short to box with God. The God Box Podcast. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to another episode. The God Box Podcast. You already know I'm the host, the finesse God, Jake Diggy92. And this the podcast where we hit you with facts and opinions. It mostly be opinions, but you know I throw a little sprinkle sprinkle of facts in that junk, right? So I gotta hit y'all with this disclaimer. And y'all look, if y'all hear a little clink clink, it's been a long ass day. I need a little drink drink. Alright. I ain't gonna get too intoxicated because I'll be slurring over these words and stuff. But uh, disclaimer: this podcast is a podcast based on some facts, but mostly my opinion. Everything you hear is from my point of view and based on my beliefs and principles. What you hear here is my thoughts and my thoughts only. And with that being said, let's get into today's topic. And I, can we just clap it up? Real quick for me not messing that damn uh, disclaimer up like I always do. Because I always butcher that thing. So can we just clap it up for the God one time? For the one time? Yes. Yes. Clap. Yes. Clap. Clap. You better be clapping. But um, not so. Look, man. Th- today's topic, man. Whew. I know it's old, but it's something I've been wanting to talk about. Um. And it came back to my attention when I seen this particular person on Instagram and they was, they was flourishing. They, they, they was definitely flourishing out this bitch. And so of course, as y'all seen in the title, we talking about the Kardashians versus Jordan. Now what's her name? Her name like Jordan Woods or something. That's her name, right? Let's see right quick. Jordan yeah jordan woods um and if we don't know who jordan woods is you finna find out by the end of this episode but um we gonna go ahead and get the facts out the way as always and then we gonna go into my opinion so look um when did this happen like maybe a few months ago um news broke on like every damn way that tristan thompson cheated with Jordan Woods. Now Jordan Woods. May sound just like any other person in y'all. And to the normal person. That don't keep up with the Kardashians. Y'all see what I did there. Um, wouldn't know who she is. But come to find out. Jordan Woods is like Kylie's best friend. Like Kylie Jenner's best friend. Like they live together. All that shit right. So news breaks. He cheating with her. So he there's pictures. They at the club. She's sitting on his lap. They kissing some more shit. Blah, blah, blah. News break. Kardashians find out. Now, this is going to be kind of a fast forward type of situation. Because the Kardashians ain't really find out until the new episode of Keeping Up with Kardashians. I think it was like... Season 16, episode 12. And that is crazy that they have been on for 16 damn seasons. But, um, that's a long ass time. But, so news break. And on the show, they are showing Chloe is going off. Motherfucking the Kardashians got that group call popping. Nigga, even Kamora Lee Simmons hopping in and talking about we can't let them take our men. Blah, blah, blah. And we're going to talk about that shit later. But, um, yeah. So, it's, it's going down. They dogging Jordan. They talking mad shit. They talking like they trying to pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up on the kid. You know what I'm saying? They look. They they also pull up, hop out. What's good type shit. Yeah, you feel me? Like, Sharkisha, no. Like, that's that's what that's what they was on. But. But at the same time, when this news broke, yeah, it broke up a family. But son, let's keep it honest, nigga. Jordan Woods flipped the hell out of this shit. She took the negative, flipped that shit into a positive. Shorty out here popping something vicious. Like, bro, you you ain't even know Jordan Woods like a year ago. She cheat with the wrong nigga and blow up. 
completely. Like, you know how many people is behind her for cheating with that nigga? Like, that shit is crazy. Like, I've never seen somebody cheat and it work out positively. Like, that's wild. So now that we done got the base story and the facts out of the way, right? We gonna get into my opinion. So, pretty much my opinion is, yeah, it's messed up. It's completely messed up. She shouldn't have cheated with her best friend's aunt's man. We get it. It's fucked up. It's a fuck, fucked up situation. I don't know if the liquor was involved. I don't know if the weed was involved. I don't know if the weed and the drugs and the lick was involved. I don't know. That's a deadly ass combination, nigga. When you off the lick, the the right one, off the lick, somebody get in this. Yeah, y'all know the rest. So, like, it's crazy and it's it's completely messed up and they both wrong in the situation. But, I have a but. Tristan ain't got the best track record. Like, that nigga cheated on you before and was on TMZ. Ain't try hide nothing that nigga gave no fucks the first time he got caught cheating and it was like with two jumps coming out the hotel he had two of them ho he bro he had two bitches you took him back like you took him back right so then news break he cheat with jordan i guess this the last straw type shit blah 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 but honestly bro chloe i'm gonna keep it a buck I did some research. That nigga cheated on his joint with you. What the fuck? How you really mad? You took this nigga from another woman. Not only did you take her, take him from another woman, that woman was pregnant with his child at the time. Bruh, you don't think he gonna do the same shit? That nigga left for some ass. He gon' tink continue to leave for some ass. So, bro, some of y'all females don't be getting this shit. If the nigga was in a relationship and he just left the bitch to be with you, nine times out of ten, something better come along. He doing the same exact thing. Like how you got him is how they gon' leave. Like. I don't see how y'all don't understand that. I guess because she thought she was a Kardashian. She put that curse on him real quick. That shit real, That shit was real because that boy NBA season was trash when he got with her. But, like, I don't know, man. I don't think I don't think these females be thinking. Like, for one, he a young, stupid young basketball player. When I say stupid young, that nigga younger than me. When I did some research, then I found out that nigga was like 23, 24 years old. Like, what you what you expect? We gonna look it up so that I got the legit facts. But but that that shit is crazy. Like this nigga's twenty eight. This nigga was born in ninety one. He in his prime. He slaying. He got bread too. You know he slaying, bro. Like, I don't get it, dog. Like, how you upset? He an NBA. Make, bro. This nigga salary. I'm looking at is fifteen point thirty three million. That was back in twenty seventeen. I don't know how much you make now, but. Bruh, a young black brother making that much to where he's probably never had, like, this amount of money in his life. He 28 years old. He he probably getting ass thrown at him from left to right. Is it acceptable? No. Do you expect it, though? Yes, some niggas ain't. Ain't shit. I'm sorry. I just had to say it. But like some niggas just ain't shit. But like. What. Like really what you expect bro. 
He left his pregnant girlfriend for you. You thought because you had the kid you were safe? That's probably why the nigga left. You ain't learned nothing from the ex, bitch. I'm a Kardashian. Fuck all that shit. And then I, I gotta talk about the um this whole Kamori Lee Simmons shit. She said we can't let them take our men. Bitch. Black men ain't y'all man. What the fuck is y'all talking? Unless she meant like the ones we with. But bruh, y'all don't own black men. A lot of black men ain't even checking for these damn Kardashians. Because a lot of black men don't like that fake shit. And I'm one of them. I don't like no fake ass ass. Who wants that? You in you in the crib. She walking around. It's not like balloons. It's crooked, crooked, crooked. Like what is that sound? Oh that's my butt. I'm sorry. Like what? Don't nobody want that shit. Like so. It's, y'all be having all this work done. Thighs don't match the butt. I seen like, what was it? It was like a trailer or something. And they was like, they was all like lined up and shit. And like walking and shit. They, they booties look trash. That shit, that shit look trash, bro. Like, who, who, who want that? Like, really, who, who wants that? There's no, nobody in their right mind. Really gonna be like, yeah, dog. I want a jump with a nice, fat, fake jump. Like I don't, I don't know if um, Chloe's jump is real, but I, I don't understand. Like a, a body ain't gonna keep somebody. Like what in the hell? Like what? Did you really think? Just because you was a Kardashian, you had some money, and all this shit, you you thought it was it was really gonna keep him. Like, did you really think that it? I I just don't understand it because people don't understand that if they left the last jump to fuck with you. What make you think they ain't going to leave you to fuck with the next jump? Like, that's what y'all got to be understanding, my ladies. Like, some niggas really ain't shit. And it's it's, it's sad to say. But, bro, like, it's, it's just the world we live in. And, like, the fact that he was so nonchalant the first time he got caught should have further let you know. He gave no fucks about you, bro. Like, at all. At all, I think she was, she had just had the kid or she was still pregnant. She was still pregnant when the nigga cheated the first time. Like, come on, bro. That's the dumbest thing ever. She was still pregnant and the nigga cheated. Like, what? The same exact thing. That's called karma, son. You can't get away from that shit. Ain't no getting away from karma, dog. Like... I don't understand, but, like, that whole Kamor shit, I was like, who the fuck even put her in this shit, to be honest? Like, where did you come from? Why were you on the three-way call? Like, what what valuable shit did you, like, have to put in? Because she was talking reckless on the phone. You talking real reckless, nephew. Like, you got too much dip on your chip. I don't know if Jordan got like sisters or something, but uh, yeah, you don't fuck with a black jump. Nah, mm-mm. But like, I I can't fake. I gotta say, big ups to Jordan, dog, cause she out here killing it. She done came out with a makeup line. Like she got clothes and collections now. Shorty cheated and came up. That's how you come up. You got to cheat on the motherfucker? Like, that's some real reckless shit, but that is crazy. She came smooth up. And then it's crazy because she actually looked good. She decent looking. It ain't even decent. Like, 
She look real. Shorty look real. I'm looking at a picture right now. Her thighs match up. Now, I don't know about these boobies. They, I mean, they look real, but they look a little too real, like too good. Like, them Jones too perfect. Like, nah, she might have had her boobs done. I don't think so. I don't know. Yeah, because they talking about surgery and shit. Yeah, she has some type of surgery. But either way, Shorty look good now. And that shit, that's crazy that she really came up off that. And then I got to send a huge shout out. Well, big up to Kylie. Because I was watching like some more clips to get some more, um, I guess, content. And... She was the only one that stuck up for uh, Jordan. Because she was like, she asked me to come get some stuff. And just she's having a rough time. And you can tell. Like, you guys, that's not cool. Y'all bashing her like that. And blah, blah, blah. And Chloe's just like, no, fuck that. Fuck that. She cheated with my man. And fuck that. Fuck. Girl, shut your stupid ass up. We all knew that shit was going to happen. Shut the fuck. Uh, like real shit. Shut up. Just shut up. Cause, shut up. That Kardashian shit. Just shut up. Cause y'all be acting like y'all motherfuckers is the world. Half of half of the motherfuckers in the world don't give a damn about no damn Kardashians. Like, I know I said that before, but that shit is so true. Like it be the it be the jumps to be like I'm too pretty to get cheated on. Be the main ones that get cheated on. Stupid ass. But I'm going to go ahead and uh, end this episode. I don't want to be rambling too much. But that was just my little two cents on this whole uh, thing. I know I'm like mad late with it. But I just felt like I wanted to talk about it since I had seen Jordan come up with her own clothing collection. I think it's like at Boohoo or some shit. So, shout out to Jordan for securing the bag. She just throws in my man and then secured the bag. That's crazy. But um, shout out to her, shout out to Kylie. And for my Kardashians, bro, y'all got to do better. I think Kendall the only one that stay out the way. You don't hear shit about Kendall ass. All you seen was Kendall killing a bottle cap challenge. That's it. You don't hear shit about Kendall. What? What's the other one? I forgot the other one name. Um, Just stay out the way. I don't never hear shit about her neither. It's Kim, uh, Chloe. I don't, I don't remember her name. But like, she stay out the way. She be super out the way. Like, that shit's crazy. But my overall thoughts is she shouldn't, she shouldn't have been surprised whatsoever. So, I'm going to go ahead and open it up for comments as always. Y'all know, y'all can email me or just comment below. I'm working on getting this podcast on iTunes, but I, iTunes keep holding me um, about, like, my metadata or something. So, once I once I figure that out, I think I'll be all right to put the podcast on iTunes. So, just stay, stay updated because uh, I know iTunes is a lot easier than SoundCloud. Because a lot of people just use iTunes on a daily. A lot of people don't have SoundCloud. So making a whole new like account just to listen to one thing. Like that's, that's probably a little bit annoying. So as soon as I can, I'm going to get this out on iTunes. But um, yeah, man, I just appreciate y'all for listening. And uh, we got to drop this disclaimer one more time before I get y'all up out of here. So this, this podcast is a podcast based on some facts, but mostly my opinion. Everything you hear is from my point of view and based on my beliefs and principles. What you hear here is my thoughts and my thoughts only. With that being said, let's do do a quick promo and I'm going to get y'all up out of here. So, you a sneakerhead, follow my sneaker channel on YouTube. That's Finesse Kicks. You want to follow me on any social media, you can find me on Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. All all of those is J Diggy ninety two J D I G G Y nine two. Um, shout out to my art page, Finesse Guy Masterpieces. Go copy out some dope ass art. I would greatly appreciate it. Um, 
And yeah, lastly, uh, shout out to Savage God Gaming. That's my uh, me and my girl Savage Beauties gaming channel. So if you like raging and all that other shit, yeah, go check it out. You'll definitely have a good laugh. I'm I'm about to record some uh some more Black Ops gameplay right now as we speak. So uh, go check that out. And uh, yeah, man, I love y'all. Thank y'all for listening. Like I always say, I will see y'all on the next episode of the God Box Podcast. Peace.